So this is a continuation of Table of Contexts. This is the, a few more details that the MOAC textbook has in it. So they, before they make the Table of Contents, they suggest making a next page section break. And we'll just turn on our Show Hide. Press Control Home to go to the top of that page and press the Enter key twice and then move the insertion point to the top line. And that means that if our page is going to run over, our table of contents is more than one page, uh, it would still always put that break in front of it. So that's a good thing. So they go ahead and they put in the table, automatic table tools to style. So we'll go ahead and do that. So there's a few different things as this seems to select everything here and allows you to control click. Clicking these three will select the entire table. Here's a table of contents that you can, uh, I guess, change from table one style here or remove it. Now, if we come back to references and click here and go to custom table of contents, then we get this dialog box and what they do is they choose simple from this general list in the formats. Simple and then click the options button and then what they do is just give you an example that if you put a 4 here and said OK and OK that you would then get this message and they say you know go ahead and click click OK and you can see that the style of this we, we chose simple and simple did not have any dot leaders and just put the page number right after the name of the heading. And then they go back in through here to custom, come back into options. Actually, first we're going to pick distinctive. We only really have two levels, so I'm just going to put two here and go to options. The three and four have disappeared. Say OK, OK, and replace. And this time you can see that it's quite a different list. And I think it would be a good idea to create one of each of these types and print them out so that you can see for yourself what the difference is from, whoa, so that's the modern style there. Looks quite different. Uh, formal. Okay, so they all have quite a different list. It would probably be good to print the front page and have a label under it labeling what type it is just so that you have a record.